Hello. The purpose of data partitioning is to divide a large input data set into multiple segments or partitions and process each partition in a separate processing node, thereby improving the performance of data stage job. We have seen round robin partitioner, random partitioner, same partitioner, entire partitioner in the previous videos. Let us see what is hash partitioning. In hash partitioning method, input records are grouped based on certain fields and the groups are randomly distributed across the processing nodes or partitions. The fields which are used to partition the data are called as hash key fields. The hash partitioner will make sure that every record belonging to a certain hash key field values are available in the same processing node or partition. This method of partitioning is particularly useful when we use remove duplicate stage, sort stage or aggregated stage in data stage jobs. The hash partitioning requires at least one column to be defined as hash key, which is the primary key field. Also, it can have multiple secondary key fields defined in the diagram in the input data set the column city has been chosen as the partition key as you can see the records with city values chennai and pune are sent to first partition or node 1 and the records with city values Mumbai and Kolkata are sent to second partition that is running on processor 2, node 2. You may observe that node 1 has a small number of records compared to that of node 2. Hence, node 2 will have to do a lot more work compared to node 1. This is the disadvantage of hash partitioning method. It creates uneven sized partitions. Hope you liked this video. If you have any questions or feedback, please do post them in the comment section. Thank you. Have a nice day.